Hey everyone, it's me Chrissy. I'm going to be doing a haul video for you today on some of the things that I just got from MAC in the new collection, Naked Honey. So I will go ahead and get started with that. Um, I got two of the lip glosses. This first one is called Queen Bee, and it's a really pretty um, corally color. I'll do a little swatch for you. Um... This, I believe, is going to be really, really pretty in this for the summertime, so that's why I decided to get it. So that's what it looks like. Really pretty coral color. So that is going to be a lot of fun to use. The next lip glass I got is in She's a Star, and it's this pretty goldy nude color. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. But I'll do another swatch here. Sorry if I sound horrible, but I'm still pretty sick and really nasally from the tonsillitis. So that's what it looks like. Very gorgeous color. <clears throat> another thing that I got that is not part of this collection, but I'll share with you, is the Cream Sheen in Creme de Nude. It's a really pretty just nude color, and every time I went to MAC, they were sold out. So they had it in, so I decided to get one. Um, I've really been into nudes lately, so that's why I picked this up. Getting back to Naked Honey. I got two of the eyeshadows. Now, I wasn't planning on getting any of the eyeshadows, because I figured, well, I have a lot of highlight colors, and I have a lot of, like, browns. So, <clears throat> I wasn't going to get them, but then when I looked at them in person, I thought they were really pretty. And I'm really trying to cut back, but um, I got them anyway. I know. Shocker. So, this first one is in Buckwheat. And it's a gorgeous, gorgeous dark brown color. And I haven't seen a prettier brown that came out with the collection in such a long time, so I just had to get it. It's a, just a gorgeous brown. It's absolutely beautiful. <laughs> this must be, this is going to be my, my new favorite brown color. I've been wearing this for the last two days in my crease, and I absolutely love it. So that's a buckbeat. The next one is in... Creme de Mel, I think that's how you pronounce it. And it's a really pretty um, beigey highlight goldy color. And that's what it looks like. Really pretty. And I'm wearing this on my lid and um, brow bone. So those are the two eyeshadows. Let me just wipe this off. Um, let's see. The next thing that I got was one of the highlighting powders. And... <clears throat> Again, I wasn't going to buy this, but once I got to the store and checked it out, I really did like it. Um, it's really pretty. That's what it looks like. It, this one is in Honey Light. <clears throat> and you can see the pretty shimmer. The only thing I don't like about these is once that top shimmer... Hold on! I'm doing a video. Once that top shimmer um, comes off, you can see I, I nicked it right in the center... Um, once the top layer comes off, you don't get that high shine. So this top layer isn't what the whole powder looks like. Once you wipe it off, it doesn't look like that. But it is a beautiful color underneath. I mean, it's very pretty because when I, when I went to the store, the top, the top part of it was already taken off. So, um, I swatched what the real color on most of the product's going to be underneath. And it was really, really pretty. I think it's going to be a gorgeous highlight color. So, that is that. I got two of the body products. This, um, body wash in... I guess it's called Naked Honey Body Wash. Oh, my God, my nose. Um, it's a really nice, faint honey smell. I really like it. Um, I haven't used it yet in the bath or shower, duh. Because every time I go into the shower, I totally forgot that I have this because my whole, um, my whole naked honey haul was sitting in the bag because I was getting ready to do the video, but I've been so sick that I haven't. I didn't make the video when I first gone to MAC, so I keep on forgetting to use this, but it's a really nice smell. 
Um, this is 100 milliliters, 3.4 fluid ounces. I did get the salve, the Naked Honey salve. Um, this is what it looks like. It's a pretty big, decent size jaw. And my hiccups. It's a 40 gram, 1.41 ounces. <clears throat> what it looks like I really really like this you can use this on your lips any dry parts of your body um, elbows feet it's gonna be great for the summer for heels um, you know you can put it on your heels and then put socks over your feet and then go to sleep and it will be kind of like a treatment overnight um, I actually have this on my lips I got a neat, um, a neat little trick for you if you um, if you pick this up um, what you can do is you can put this on your lips and take your favorite lip pencil. Um, mine would either be Sore or Whirl. And you go ahead and you put it on and then you put this on your lips and you kind of, you know, do that. And you got your own little made up tinted lip color and you did it yourself and you, you know, that's actually what I have on my lips. So if you like what I have on my lips, you should definitely check it out. So, oh, you can either line your lips first and then put it on. Do whatever you want. And it smells really nice. You can put it on your hands. Anything. I really like it. I mean, it feels like a little, like, sh like, not sticky. It's, like, very, sl I guess, like, slimy. It's like petroleum jelly, so... It's going to have that, you know, feeling to it. It comes in this little tin. And you turn it on, and that's what the packaging looks like. Um, I, had a, I had a feeling that this stuff is going to go quick. So I picked up another one just in case. Now, I don't know if I'm going to go through this pretty fast. I don't know. But um, I picked up another one. Either I'm going to save it for me or maybe possibly sell it if these things sell out. If it was anything like the ash, um, the volcanic ash exfoliator like last year, people will, were, were buying them on eBay for up, an obscene amount of money. So I don't know, maybe I'll sell it on eBay if it go, runs out. I don't really know. We'll see what happens. Um, so basically that's it for my haul. Uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.